Namaste friends, welcome to Learn with Jay, empowered by Magic Needle. This day I am here with a beautiful floral motif which is titled as Thai Orchids. And uh, this is worked in the round and we are not converting it into a square, we are leaving it as such. Okay, And this can be converted into a square, if we want further we can work and make a Thai Orchid square too. So without wasting much time friends, let us go into the video and go about the stitches how we go about for making this particular Thai orchid chain 6 and slip stitch to the first chain and join to form a ring inside this ring place 12 single crochets chain 1 to secure place 12 single crochets and she'll place 12 single crochets and get back I shall place 12 single crochets and get back I have come to the end of the round here, slip stitch to the first single crochet join and in the second round we are going to place two double crochets in each of these single crochets. So you can chain three for the first double crochet and one double crochet in the same stitch. And place two double crochets so there will be 24 double crochets at the end of this round. We made 12 single crochets in the round. So place 24 double crochets, 2 in each. I shall also place and get back. I have completed round 2 here. Now I need to slip stitch to the third chain of the 3 chains that I have done. So this is the first loop and the second loop. Every chain will have 3 loops. So slip stitch and now for the third round you are going to place one single crochet each in each of the 24 double crochets. So chain 1 and then place the first single crochet in the same, same stitch that will be a little tight to pick up but doesn't matter. This is the first single crochet. One single crochet each on each of the double crochets. So place the stitches I shall make, I shall complete and get back. Now with right side facing, I have come to the end of this row here, so single crochet row. So insert the hook for slip stitch and pick up the second color. To this, pull this tight, chain one. place one single crochet in the same stitch where we did the slip stitch chain 5 Skip next two stitches, place a single crochet in the next. So this round is a chain, chain 5 and a single crochet. So again chain 5, skip 2 and a single crochet in the next. So every third chain you are going to place a single crochet spaced by 5 chains. Complete this round, I shall also complete and get back. And you can cut the color A yarn. We come to the end of the round here, chain 5. Slip stitch to the first single crochet that we started with. And 
and place a single crochet in the same stitch so you need to chain one and then place a single crochet here and the next chain five space place half double crochet three double crochets now we are going to do pico cluster chain 3 chain 4 in the first chain slip stitch again chain 3 slip stitch into the same chain space again chain 3 slip stitch into the same space so this is pico cluster now place three double crochets one half double crochet and now you have come to the single crochet please chain, place a single crochet on single crochet So this stitch repeat you repeat in each of the chain five spaces and on the single crochet i shall also complete and get back come to the end of the round here now slip stitch to the first single crochet and fasten this off i shall be back with color c now right side facing slip stitch color c to any of this single crochets here you can make a standing single crochet let me make the slip knot and come back that will be better so this is a single crochet so i have made my standing single crochet here chain 7 Hope the standing single seven single crochet was seen. I'll do it again. Slip knot, insert the hook into the stitch indicated. This is the single crochet there. Holding it on with your fingers, holding the other yarn, pick up the working yarn and make the single crochet. Chain seven. single crochet in the middle pico again chain 7 single crochet in single crochet so continue this stitch pattern all around for this particular round I shall also place these stitches and get back to you <coughs> We come to the end of this round here. No slip stitch to the first single crochet here and join. <coughs> Sorry. Now into this seven chain space, place eight single crochets. We are not working on the SCs anymore. We are working only in the chain spaces. Now make three pico cluster. <coughs> chain four. Slip stitch to the first chain, 
now chain 3 slip stitch again to the same chain chain 3 again slip stitch into the same space so 3 pico cluster is made now place 8 single crochets in the next chain 7 space So you place 8 single crochets. Now jump over to the next chain space. Place 8 single crochets. So this is the stitch repeat you need to make in each of the chain 7 spaces. That is each set of chain 7 spaces. So you will have at the end you will have 8 picos on top of the picos here. Okay continue the pattern complete and get back i shall also complete and get back you come to the end of this <coughs> final round here slip stitch to the first single crochet join and fasten off oh, sorry Here we go. So we have completed this beautiful floral motif. It is titled as Thai Orchids. It's Thai Orchid motif. Hope you enjoyed the stitch pattern. I shall be back with yet another pattern in the next video. I a humble request. Please do subscribe to Magic Needles channel. Do not forget to click on the bell icon so that you are notified of the videos that we upload every other day. I Bye for now friends. Have a great day.